Back home and parents at a northeastern suburbs high school say they'll fight state government plans to merge it with a nearby primary school. Widespread mergers are now government policy, but the school's governing council says it removes freedom of choice. Putting pen to paper to save Modbury High School, one of 67 schools headed for merger. I think there's a lot for the kids to be at one school all the way through right up through the high school. I reckon it won't go too good with it. Modbury High was told late last year that it would merge with the adjacent Modbury South Primary School. The school's governing body says it's been told little else, but is worried about staff cuts, possible fee increases and additional costs to parents for new school uniforms. We're not going to take this. We want our school as it is and we are prepared to fight it for as long as we need to. The council claims half of the school's 950 students are from outside the area because parents want to send their children to a traditional high school. It's worried that soon parents will have no choice. To find that quite likely the school that you've bypassed, this one is going to be no different in the future, is a big blow. This decision has been made and now we will see some charade of the Minister and Department going through the motions to make it appear as though uh, they've included consultation. The state government says no mergers will occur before 2013, that it had consulted with the School Governing Council and would continue to do so. Emma Rebellato, ABC News, Adelaide.